I've been lucky enough to take a break from the kitchen and visit this luxurious oasis in the heart of Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. With direct access to a theme park and a wildlife park, the Sunway Resort Hotel has plenty to keep you entertained. And of course, for foodies, there's an array of dining options from fine dining to casual cafes. At the resort cafe, they celebrate Malaysia's diverse cultural influences, serving up a range of local and international cuisine. Afik is one of the main chefs here, and he's going to show me how to make what is probably Malaysia's most loved dish. Nazi lemak would have to be Malaysia's national dish. There's lots of different components to it. Does it start with the rice? Yeah, well, let's start with the rice, you know. Okay. Um, we have the, the rice here, mm -hmm. and then uh, Justin, would you like to put water and the coconut milk? Yeah. Yeah. And with the rice, is there a trick to making it perfect? Like, do you have to wash the rice a few times? Yes, yeah, correct. We have to wash it three times. Three yeah. times? Yeah. Not four times? No, three times. <laughs> three times. <laughs> okay. And coconut milk? Yeah, three cups of that. And is nazi lemak something that you would have uh, for lunch or dinner or is it for breakfast? It's a staple food for Malaysian. Uh, we eat in the breakfast, lunch or even uh, in dinner time. Any time? Yeah, yeah, oh, right. so yeah. good. Yeah, would you like to add a shallot and ginger as well? Yep. Okay. And lastly, we need to put the pandan leaves. Pandan leaves. Right. It will oh. give more fragrant smell for the rice. It's so beautiful. Okay, so in it goes. So we shake it a little bit. Mm -hmm. And so without this rice, mm -hmm. there is no nasi lemak? Yeah, no nasi lemak. Nasi lemak means uh, rice cooked with the coconut. Beautiful. Yeah, and then we straight into the rice cooker. Yep. It will take around 30 minutes to cook. So the chicken, we're going to marinate with blue ginger. Okay. Yeah. A it's... bit different to traditional ginger? Yeah, Can it's I have different. a smell? Ah, it's, a... oh, it's fragrant. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm. and then we go with the lemongrass. Lemongrass. Uh, this one we need a lot. And uh, turmeric? Yep. We need around uh, two spoons. You know what I love? It's everything is fresh and yeah. you've chopped it or ground right. it here. It's not uh, turmeric from the packet, it's fresh no, turmeric. It's fresh, we, we, yeah. Yeah, we ground it. So this is coriander seed and cumin seed. Mm -hmm. uh, Justin, would you like to help me to ground it? Yes, I would love to. And have you toasted these spices off? Yes, we toasted. Now, this is a very traditional Malay dish. Yeah, right. Malay food, how can you describe it? Um, we have influence in uh, many from our neighbouring country like uh, Thailand and Indonesia. Yes. So we share the same ingredients, we share the same uh, spices, mm. but we cook in different way. Different way. Yeah. How's that? Yeah, that's good. Okay. That's good. So we're going to put it in. Yeah. And this is just chicken Maryland, the drumstick and the chicken thigh together. Right. We season it. Uh, nasi lemak, is it always with chicken or you can have all different uh, types no, of We things? can have with uh, squid, uh, we can have with uh, uh, quails. Quail. Quail. Yeah, we can substitute this with quail. Yeah, beautiful. Curry leaves. Right. Now we have to massage it. I can right do that. Here. Okay, use a glove. Right. <laughs> you did say to me, make sure I wear a glove because right. the turmeric, it stains. Yes. <laughs> And how long do we marinate this for? Ah, uh, it's good for three hours in the fridge. Beautiful. It smells. Oh, yeah, it, it smells, smells so very good. fresh of yep. the. Okay, let's just marinate and okay. then we start to cook the sambal. Fantastic. Okay, put that there. So sambal mm. is very important. Right. No sambal, no nasi lemak. Okay, fantastic. <laughs> so to cook the sambal, we need a lot of oil. We need to basically fry the ingredients, not to sweat it. And then, okay. and then later on, we can uh, move the oil uh, after we cook them. Is that so it develops all the flavours right, and gets correct. different depths of flavour? Okay. Yeah. More? Yeah, more. A little more? bit more oil. Okay, that's good. So, onion in first. Beautiful. Okay. So, yeah, it's definitely frying nice and caramelised straight away. Right. <laughs> and then now it's time for the chilli. Lots of chilli. Yeah. Do you like sambal really hot? Uh, medium. Medium hot with uh, some uh, sweetness yes. inside there. Yeah. Especially if you're going to have this for breakfast. Personally, I don't yeah. like it too hot for breakfast. Right, <laughs> it's too hot. All right, Justin, we can put some garlic there. Okay. Just a Ooh, little bit here. Lots of garlic. Yeah. And then we need the tamarind. And that's tamarind paste? Yeah, tamarind mm -hmm. paste. Mm -hmm. Just a little bit for some uh, uh, sour taste sour for the sambal. Taste. Yeah. Yes. Next is the brown sugar. A little sprinkle? Yes, little sprinkle of sugar. It's very much about balance. 
Right. The sour, the sweet, the, the and, heat. And actually, this uh, will give some more colour, reddish colour to the sambal. Okay. Yeah. And how long do you want to cook this for? Uh, we're going to cook it for about 20 minutes. 20 minutes? Yeah. Beautiful. And yeah. I guess in that time, we can fry the chicken. Right. Alright, chicken is ready. Okay. Now, Justin, I'm going to add uh, some uh, curry leaves. Yep. Just uh, give a little bit of uh, smells of this Beautiful. chicken. Oh, straight and away, when you put those curry leaves in, it's so aromatic. Beautiful. Right. And then... Lovely. We can take the chicken, put up here. Yep. Yeah. And then we take all... So, how do you assemble a nazi lemak? We've got the coconut rice, the main ingredient. I should go with this... Uh, Anchovies. Anchovies. Yeah. Look at them. They're so little. Yeah. Crispy fried anchovies. Right. And some uh, mm. fried peanuts. Oh, that's nice. Yep. Uh, cucumber. That's texture. Eh? Right. Mm. And then uh, we go with the sambal. Sambal, okay. And you can see in the sambal, the last few things that we added to that, some shallots or those purple onions and right. quail eggs. How fantastic is that? Yes, quail I egg. love quail eggs. But you could just use hard-boiled eggs for this, couldn't you? Yes, yeah. it can be a hard-boiled egg as well. Yeah, and the chicken on the top. Mm -hmm. There you go. And don't forget all these beautiful curry right. leaves. They smell fantastic. Lovely. Yeah. And if you thought there wasn't enough ingredients already, what have you got here? This is the fried lemongrass and uh, blue ginger, just for garnish. Wow. Nazi lemak, it's a very special dish. You know, it takes a long time to cook this. There are many ingredients. So when you have a chef like Afik cooking this for you, you know it's going to be delicious. Yeah, Can't wait sure. to try this. Chef, thank okay. you very much. Welcome.